I, Anita Evelyn. While addressing ministers who turned up at Kololo ceremonial grounds to take oath of office, President Museven took time to inform the country of the decline in COVID-19 infections as a result of the ongoing lockdown. Before the, the lockdown, when you would check 100 people for corona, 17 of them would be positive, would be having the virus. But now, this was a few days ago, because of the lockdown, when we check, we check 100 people, we found that only 8 or up, up to 10 are, are positive. So it has already worked. The president criticized religious leaders and political leaders across the divide who undermined the threat of coronavirus infections in the first wave that hit the country. He says the country has learned a great lesson from the rich nations that chose to share the vaccine among themselves, leaving out the poor nations. We now know, we, know, we now know that people who say they are Christians, actually they are not. And it's a good lesson. And that's why therefore, we are also working very hard to develop our own vaccines. The president also broke silence on social media posts that have been making rounds about his health. Social media apparently has been saying that M7 is dead. Now the other day when I went to side of Bombo to lay a foundation, started, people were looking very, very, because they thought they had been told by social media that M7 is dead or something like that. So the security service needs also to solve that problem. President Museveni commented on the progress into the investigations of Katumba shooting. And now we have broken that, that group. Uh, three of them have been killed because they were trying to, to fight the police. The police just uh, sent them to, to hell. Aaron Mukama, NTV.